Hey everyone, it's Mindy Hahn, the Midwest Premier Sports Handicapper, coming to you from TonySpicks.com and the half of the morning show duo, The Morning Steam with Ramon Scott. Uh, but hope you enjoy this free pick video from our show. Uh, be sure to click in the link in the description for our best bets. Now here is the pick. TCU in Texas, Christian. Uh, Texas and TCU. Texas, yeah. In Texas, you Christian. cannot play Texas Christian, obviously. But were you? Really, did you really apply to go to Northwestern? To be a no, uh, uh, no, no, no. I would, uh, I would have I, uh, Northwestern or Syracuse. You know, maybe I could have made something of myself, but uh, I didn't know if that's uh, you know where you applied to go because you wanted to do your sports writing. Back it's in too the day. cold. Just too cold. It is too cold there. That's for sure. <laughs> go there. But you said your family's kind of from Wisconsin, though, right? Yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. So I mean it's we, cold there too. We are Wisconsinites. I've never you know, I go there we never you know. Never, because it's cold. Never ever. <laughs> thought my I thought, you know, I thought because I run the show on my own personal face run this show on my own personal Facebook page. I thought I'd get lots of friends and family and watching. And I guess they just scroll right on by. <laughs> I've never seen one friend or family member say you know, hi, hey, like, does it work? Like, when I scroll by, I see all these, you know, does mine not play? Do I not show up on there? Have I been blocked from there? Have you been blocked? Yeah, that's the real question. Every time I put, you know, stupid stuff on Facebook, people comment all the time. And when I started doing this show, I said, you know what, I'm going to put my show, because, like, it's me every day commenting on the day's events plus sports, maybe my friends and family, not one if I have any friend and family watching right now, comment in the chat. <laughs> Not you guys. You guys are my friends already. Uh, funny. Okay. TCU two and a half here. One forty nine and a half. Uh, again, another good one. But I have Texas winning this one outright by about three. So I'm going to definitely take the points here. Uh, Texas better offensive and defensive. Uh, efficiency regarding uh, this matchup here. Longhorns also six and one against the spread the last seven. TCU suddenly is only uh, one and five against the spread here as of late. Going with the Longhorns here today. Brent can't get TCU right. <laughs> Scott says. Uh, you know, take them. Yeah, no, Kong, you guys are my new family. Forget those right. people. Okay. Thomas, Lou, everybody Texas here, it looks like. Fernando, Tech, looks like Fernando is going to be a good contributor. Yes. And maybe sure. Joel as well. Let's get nice. back Yeah, there. it's good that you guys are getting in there. Get, get in the game. And it looks like some disagreement there. And I don't know. I can't. I don't know if I'm necessarily agreeing with with uh, Mindy here in this one, I'm probably have to look to the, uh, to the total. And that's a big number, but not Ramon. Well, it's a big number, but it doesn't necessarily seem out of the question uh, with these two teams right now. I think that's a, a direction that I would probably look uh, to go on the other. I mean, uh, look, this one's going to be a, a, a case where uh, look, it might end up, it might end up, it's not going to be, if I lose this, Mindy, it's going to be 147 or 148. It's not going to be like, I don't think it's going to be 135. Right. I have uh, it at 147-ish. Okay. Well, and then I can see. But, um, you know, <laughs> Texas 4-1 and one to the over as an underdog. I'm going to take the over in this one with Texas and TCU 149 and a what half. Do they, what did they have last game out total-wise? Do you have that info? In the Penn State game or no, the Texas TCU? What was the total in their in their last head-to-head -head matchup? Yeah, do you have that? When they played, yeah, 143 and a half, and the okay. final was 154. That was on January 11th, a 79. Okay. They did go over, okay. Yeah, 79, 75 win for Texas. They did not cover six and a half points. Right. So Cool. And Brent says that injury concerns in that particular matchup. Check that out. Uh, but again, uh, one thing to point out, uh, Brent, 
that while that it may be true, the line certainly was reflected of the injuries. And, um, you know, sometimes we're also just I, 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 most of my plays are going to be spot plays, you know, but Jamal, Jamon says no miles. So again, sometimes that, you know, teams are going to are apt to cover when they're missing, you know, uh, top players. Oh, here's uh, Fernando TCU, uh, you know, better on the road. He says actually, or, and now they're at home here. We know. So Walking Spotted Bear has his concerns about uh, the injuries in this game. Total moving up, too, by the way. I'm showing a 150 right now at one book. So, yeah, they have injury concerns in this game. Three players questionable in this one. So, might be a good play here with Mindy. So thanks for watching and make sure you get over to the Tony'sPicks.com website right now and check out our All Cappers tab where you can purchase some of our own personal picks. And be sure to go ahead and use the promo code TONYT at checkout to save 20%. Okay, have fun. Watch another video. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.